Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This reading for today. Sorry guys, let me just put the um let me just put the microphone. Okay. Okay. So this reading for today, Scorpio, this is your weekly collective reading. In today's reading, Scorpio, we will pick up love. Okay. This is a love message. This is a love reading. This is a love message for Scorpio. Let us see what is happening towards you. What is a message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know this is for the sign of Scorpio, okay? Before I start, Scorpio, I would like to thank you guys for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. And if you would like to further connect with me, Scorpio, all you need to do is to check out the description box below. You will see the details of my website. And um, our website, it has the products and the services that we offer outside of the YouTube platform. Also, Scorpio, we have a donation drive. Um, all, of the, all of the funds that we will be getting in the donation, we will be... Um, putting it towards a charity event at the end of this year i always have that charity event so december full month of december um we will have a four week event for charities so if you're interested to help thank you very much in advance um it could be any amount so thank you scorpio okay let's see what's coming towards you what's the message for love relationship dating getting to know what can i get for scorpio love relationship dating getting to know what can i get for scorpio please okay let's see okay this is a love reading what can i get for scorpio queen of swords hmm someone is watching you scorpio queen of swords you've got the three of cups the two of cups hmm and the two of pentacles okay you could be dealing with a Gemini, a Libra, Aquarius energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, and you've got the, 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 the two of pentacles. Um, so the first message is that you're dealing with someone who, they're quite a snob. <laughs> you're dealing with someone who is busy and they're very moody. Okay, you're dealing with someone who's very moody they're they're busy they have a mood you're, i mean two of cups is here it means that this person it could be a current relationship it could be an ex it could be a dating or a getting to know but this person likes you okay you have captured their attention scorpio you have captured their attention you have captured their heart you have captured them in a unique way two of cups okay they like you they love you but they also find you stubborn or they don't like you if you are easy okay someone likes you but someone likes you when you're complicated <laughs> um because the three of cups because this is the queen of swords and this is a three of cups so this person is really very serious into commitment into relationship in life and they really can connect with you there's a lot of interest there's a lot of love there's a lot of likeness towards you because i'm picking up a collective breathing it could be an ex it's someone you're dealing with it is someone that you're dealing with right now scorpio okay um if you're not talking to this person you are you're still energetically connected with them, telepathically connected with them and you're manifesting them okay the thing is queen of swords three of cups they want from three this three of cups this is dating getting to know talking flirting it's downgraded to the two of cups so this is a good progress okay i would say this person who's quiet a little bit snobby um they know that they're quite different 
this person knows that they're special. Uh, they're different, they're special, they've got something to say, okay? And you have captured their heart, attention, it's possible that this person fallen in love with you, that's why you're in your, you are in a relationship right now. The thing is, they don't want you easy. They don't want you, sorry, I have to say this word, they don't want you if you're acting silly, jealous, or stupid, okay? Sorry, I have to say those words. It means that this person, they have so much respect and love and admiration to you. So if you're acting jealous, silly, or I don't know, um, maybe when I say stupid, it means like they find, like if you chase them, you know, sorry for the word, but I'm, I'm just a reader. I'm just, you know, I, I listen to the words from, yeah, maybe it's just to exaggerate, but you are someone who's special and you shouldn't act that way okay so yep you this person likes you you've captured their attention their hearts they really like you love you but this is good but if this person is acting two of pentacles it's because there's they're they're quite put off okay they're put off maybe you were chasing them maybe there was something too easy about you Maybe there was something that you did that they didn't like, so they're acting not interested. Let's put it that way, or hesitant, two of pentacles, okay? Now let's solve the puzzle. They have drama, okay? Okay, all right. What is, okay, how do they feel about you? Ooh, look at that, ace of swords, told you guys. Queen of swords, this is the ace of swords. They feel solidly connected with you, interested with you. There is something in what you did, what you say, that I would, I would say they were put off, okay? That they have to pull away from you, okay? So this is how they think. Let's look at how they feel and what is their next plan, okay? Ooh, look at that. Feelings, ready to fall in love, ready to forgive, ready to forget. Okay, what is their next plan, okay? four of wands it's a long way what but they'll get there this person might visit you at home this person might come into conclusion okay enough of being upset with scorpio or enough of playing hard to get with scorpio because you are a good catch scorpio you are you scorpio you are a good catch and if you act less of your value this person will be turned off or put off okay all right let's see. let's see like this person would like to chase you so don't chase them that's the way i'm getting in here like they're quite strong they want you as an equal okay this card yeah eight of cups two pentacles this card wanted to come out okay yeah sun card good yeah, right now, okay, right now, Scorpio, you are worried, you are overthinking, you are somehow feeling disconnected with this person. This person, they haven't lost their interest with you, um, they're still somehow put off but they will realize that there is no one compared to you and they will realize that their feeling it would go away they will get over it whatever whatever they feel awkward not nice not okay prejudgment whatever they feel towards you that they judge you or whatever you said or whatever feeling that made them disinterested towards you scorpio it will go away so they're acting detached they're also very busy but you have a lot of good cards in here or good energy i mean you've got a two of cups you've got humor you've got ambition you have pretty face scorpio you've got everything that they need and you don't have to chase you just relax because they're acting detached you know it's just to recalibrate how they feel and this person is like oh let me just figure things out when if i feel if i still feel the same it's it's a glitch 
let's put it that way this person is your equal do not chase you just give whatever is needed in the situation no more no less and i tell you this person sun card would eventually reply respond and things will go back to normal so you've got a person who i would say they had a moment of panic and a moment of annoyance let's put it that way or a glitch they will resume their interest with you the sun card right now it's kind of eight of cups hmm. let me just leave you there scorpio you're acting awkward weird or i don't know tactless like something talkative that you shouldn't say these things or you shouldn't do that because i want you to be my equal they want you the way you are don't over give don't try so hard but don't worry it will reset the sun card they will be interested with you again it's just a glitch okay scorpio so i want you to keep yourself busy preoccupied with self-love self-care there's nothing to worry there's nothing to panic they're still interested with you they will catch up on you scorpio so just keep yourself busy put yourself into you know um self-love self-care um plan your day uh, focus on work plan productivity then plan something for yourself or friends for family you just keep on going day by day this person will come around their big girl or big boy they'll come around okay all righty so that's the first reading i feel like there is a very good outcome you know the time apart it will just make this person think that they shouldn't be acting this way there's a sun card so things will resume and things will reset between the two of you scorpio have confidence have faith okay let's see what else is coming towards you you have the six of pentacles i'm picking up an x Ooh, king of wands whoa scorpio scorpio the magician card okay seven of cups style of one card okay so you have an x okay i would say you have an i would say you're ready to fall in love again with another person it's possible that you're dating or getting to know but your your energy is outward you're going there okay you're putting yourself out there now this ex of yours somehow you have an open door policy okay now this ex of yours they've been wanting to call or text or catch up with you or wanted to know how things with you since last month okay last month now they feel like october november december this is a right month or right time king of wands six of pentacles you know like it's been a while um it's not too bad to follow up with scorpio and to see how scorpio how is going on with scorpio this lover of yours this ex lover of yours they're now planning to reach out and schedule they feel like okay you know months or weeks has passed and scorpio and i somehow have moved on and i'm i'm now ready i'm seeking like this person is seeking for a balance a king of wands looking at the scale I'm seeking for a text, a call, a resolution, something between you and me. Okay, there's someone who's planning to to seek some answer with you, Scorpio, King of Wands. Um, magician card. With the magician card, they're open to anything. If they pick up that you are still interested in love with them, they will pursue you. If you're not, they will they will let it be leave it be let it be but they're open to whatever you will give them scorpio they're open to connect and stay whether you say let's just be friends or we could try they're open to that they're open in a conversation where you will stay okay this person they're not open 
to disconnect. They're open to anything that will keep you, Scorpio. Yeah. It will confuse you, Seven of Cups. When this person comes and talk to you or call you or text or email you, it will confuse you. Because this person is still attached with a commitment, with something that they want to get rid of it. But if they do that, they want you to be there. You know, it would be it would be good idea that if they get rid of this commitment or if they finish this commitment or something that blocked between the two of you, that you would be there, you know. Let's look at the Hierophant card. Okay. Yeah, Three of Wands. They plan, like this person is preparing for a comeback. Yeah, this, there's an ex preparing for a comeback. Let me just write it down. So your person is preparing to come back. And this is the reason why this person's like, I'm open to connect with you, Scorpio. But I'm not okay if we disconnect. We should stay as friends or you can accept me as a lover because I'm planning to return to you. I'm planning to get rid of this. So this person is wanting to hit two birds at the same stone while they get rid of this or while they complete the block between the two of you they want you to stay because it's there in it's it would be their advantage that they're talking to you and in the background they're cleaning up the big mess the big block the commitment that's preventing you and them two birds at the same stone scorpio it is an x definitely an x eight of pentacles three of wands so they don't want to waste time they want to be friends with you they want to connect with you and at the same time they want to get rid of this or remove the blockage so when they complete removing whatever is blocking you together when they complete this you're there you're ready so the transition the handover it's going to be quick because you're already there that is how they think you know so when this is done, you automatically will be in the picture. That is what they want. This ex of yours. They're the king of wands. So what do you expect? The king of wands wants what he wants. You know, hmm. that's their plan. I don't know what your plan, Scorpio, but that's their plan. Obviously, they still want your romantic, Scorpio. Okay, let's see what else is coming towards you. Let's see if you've got someone new, dating, getting to know. Dating and getting to know. Dating and getting to know. Someone new, please. Someone new. Oh, the devil card. The strength card. The two of swords. Hmm. There's something around last month. Yeah, High Priestess. For some of you guys, High Priestess. Okay. Tower card. Oh, wow. This, these are powerful. For some of you guys, if you are looking for new love, Scorpio. I'm kind of getting like you started something last month. And you need to continue that because it is allowing you, whatever you started last month, it would help you to have new love. I'm also getting like with the devil card, your confident or your love for yourself vibe and energy, it's a little bit low. So I'm kind of getting like with the strength card, the two of swords, you will meet new love or new love will be successful to you once you have an inner and outer glow up okay this there's a you know there is something that you would need to complete that you need to do on your own or to yourself before you could actually 
make it more successful in terms in terms of dating or dating or getting to know i think it's more of a reflection inner glow up that's what i'm getting in here with the devil card you know because the high priest is in here yeah nine of wands you are scorpio you are still guarded so if you want to un if you want to love and date again you need to work on your you need to work on the nine of wands you need to be a little bit vulnerable and to be vulnerable you need to have a lot of confidence so you can control what you say what you do your feelings and stop repeating i'm kind of getting like very st a strong vibe okay stop repeating the same mistake scorpio and also it's, it's very important to have an inner glow up because the devil card i'm looking at their body like maybe there's a cleanse that you need to do smudge okay smudge scorpio so thank you scorpio i will see you soon you have a great day bye bye